from the minute the Lexus mark influenced its introduction at the North American International Auto to appear in Detroit 29 years prior, the LS has been the division's lead. Be that as it may, the extravagance section, much the same as whatever remains of the car advertise, progressively is getting some distance from vehicles and toward hybrids. So Lexus is trying things out for what it names another leader extravagance hybrid with the introduction of the LF1 limitless idea at the current year's Detroit Automobile Expo. What does a range topping Lexus hybrid resemble? A considerable measure like an Infiniti QX70, things being what they are. The extents absolutely reflect those of the hybrid initially known as the FX presumably on the grounds that, similar to the Infiniti, the Lexus utilizes a back-drive engineering. That takes into account a long hood, a liberal dash-to-pivot proportion, and short front shape. While the organization specifies the idea's back-drive roots, with respect to the motor, clearly that is the place the word limitless comes in. Lexus shrugs and says it could have energy component, half and half, module crossbreed, fuel, or even all-electric power. Size-wise, the LF1 is extensively bigger than the now ceased average size Infiniti, 3.5 inches longer in wheelbase, 6.1 inches longer by and large, more than 2 inches more extensive, and almost 2 inches lower. The idea's flanks are smooth, with surfacing that is less occupied than we've seen on generation Lexus models recently. In advance, in any case, the axle grille is taken to a much more noteworthy extraordinary. The midway mounted Lexus logo seems, by all accounts, to be applying gravitational draw on all the belt components encompassing it, making a cartoonish, difficult looking scowl. One can dare to dream it will be conditioned down for creation. The other outside peculiarity is the back spoiler, which has a huge hole in the middle, in the middle of, the liftgate glass seems to wrap up onto the rooftop. All the more routinely for an idea in any event the LF1 likewise includes flush entryway handles, which uncover a Lexus logo when they fly out, and rides on 22-inch wheels. The LF1 is only a hair longer than the new 3-push Lexus RX350L, however it has just 4 seats inside. Every one of the 4 seats are a similar high-supported, white cowhide upholstered basins. Before the driver there's a focal instrument screen flanked by two side C camera shows. Physical catches and handles are to a great extent expelled, normally, with the vehicle rather reacting to motion controls and a touch-touchy haptic board on the middle support. Raised situate riders have screens incorporated with the front seat backs and their own haptic board. Dull dark colored cowhide, metal accents, and genuine wood spruce up the inside, the wood entryway trim has modest openings enlightened by LEDs in various hues. Independent driving ability, here called chauffeur mode, is obviously included, human pilots can control vehicle speed with paddles nearby the controlling wheel, and moving is by means of catches on the wheel center point. Until further notice, Lexus isn't stating whether a creation form of the LF1 would supplant the LS, be sold close by it, or sit above it in the lineup. Should the LF1 achieve showrooms, we'd say the landing of a hybrid lead would check the third greatest occasion in the brand's history, after the presentations of the RX, the long-term top merchant, and the first LS400 every one of the three of which were first observed at the Detroit Automobile Expo.